Seeing you do good and progress is a nightmare to them because your success to them is their biggest failure. They fear that once you reach the top, you are gonna leave them behind and forget about them. So that's why they spend every waking moment of their life spying and plotting on you to sabotage what you have going on so you don't leave them behind and go to the next level. The truth is there are 24 hours in a day. So at any moment, they could start to get on their purpose and work towards whatever they are trying to accomplish and meet you on the same frequency. But no, they'd rather go against you, try to tear you down, center your name and bring you down to their level. But guess what? You are a thousand steps ahead of them. You will never be on their level. Or should I say they will never be on your level because you are much higher than them. They vibrate at a lower frequency, you vibrate higher. And their all around goal is to do whatever they can to lower your vibrations so you don't receive the blessings that the universe has for you. I gotta tell you, if you have haters and if anybody is trolling and hating on you, that means you're doing something right. Anybody going against you, trying to bring you down, you are doing something right. And what I gotta say to that is congratulations and keep going because they wouldn't be studying you so hard trying to get back into your life if you weren't the, if you were the problem. They say that you were a major problem in their life, so that's why they cut you off, but let me ask you this. If you were the so-called problem in their life, why are they trying so hard to get back into your life? Why are they trying to why are they trying to reconcile? Why are they spying on you? Because they know that they were wrong. They were actually the toxic ones in the relationship. And they're trying to figure out a way to get back into your life, to get back on your good graces, to capitalize off of your blessings. They were actually the toxic one. They were actually the problem. They were the ones that needed to heal and get some help. But no, they are trying to sabotage you and saying that you're the one with the problem when it's actually them. So like I said, they're going to try to do everything in their power to stop you but they can't stop you because you're always one step ahead of them. You have great potential. You have great talent and you have natural confidence. These people pretend to be confident. Their confidence is putting others down to make themselves look good. Honestly, if you got to put others down to make yourself feel good or look good, you need to take a good look in the mirror because you are insecure as F and you have some self healing and, self-worth techniques that you need to work on but you you don't put others down to make yourself feel better and look good you are naturally confident on your own you're naturally confident by being yourself being kind to others being helpful doing good deeds and spreading positivity all around the globe and people love you for it and they are jealous of that they are jealous that they don't have the same qualities and techniques that you do. And so they're going to try to do everything in their power to try to sabotage you because they are insecure within themselves. And they feel that they don't have any natural talents within them, which they do. But the truth is they're too busy spying on your life, trying to get inside your business and stop what you have going on instead of worrying about themselves. What I don't get is why do people spend most of their time trying to be in other people's presence if they don't like them? If you don't like me, just stay away. Don't friend me on social media. Don't spy on me. Don't try to pretend that you are for me when you're deep down inside can't stand me or hate my guts. Just stay away. But no, it's the light that you have within you that they want. They love the light, but they cannot stand you. They hate that you have it. And they want it for themselves, but it's too bad because God planted that light within you to share with the world and everybody else and to show off your full potential and capabilities. They don't like it. That's just too bad. They need to take it up with the man upstairs. But yeah, you just keep doing what you're doing. Keep striving. Keep elevating. You're doing a great job. You are amazing. Don't let the haters get to you. Use their negativity and 
trash talking as motivation to evolve even more. You can transmute their insults into power and grow and use that energy to grow even more. Use that to manifest more abundance. Use that to become stronger. I believe in you. You can do it. But yeah, they want to get back into your life so bad. What they really want to do is sabotage you. But that'll never happen because you are highly protected. And there's no nobody, no hater or demon from hell can stop you. So, yeah. Well, I hope you all had an amazing day. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Stay blessed, not stress. I'll be back with some more fire content. Y'all have a good one. Peace. And give the haters a show to watch. Because you know they're still lurking. They're always lurking. They don't got nothing else better to do. So let's put on a show for them. All right, y'all. Y'all have a good one.